In this WordPress tutorial, I'm going to go over how to change the theme or look of your page. If I go back to my website here, I'm using the 2010 theme, and it's okay. Um, it looks kind of plain. I want something a little bit more flashy. So if I go back to my dashboard, on the left-hand side, I can scroll down and change the appearance of my site. If I click on Appearance and Themes, WordPress will show me 151 different themes that I could use. And you can organize them by popularity or newest. Okay, I have it just selected under random. You can scroll through here. Some of them you have to purchase. So the premium ones, you have to pay a one-time fee, in this case $45, if you really want a special site. But there's plenty of uh, free sites that you could use that are just as nice. So if I scroll down here, uh, I can check out the different sites. Uh, I kind of like this Mystique one has a nice appeal. It's got a nice image there. So I can click on Activate, and you can read little bits about each theme. I'm going to click Activate, and again, you can always change back to the one you liked before. I can go back to my dashboard, and now I can see what my site looks like now with the Mystique theme. So it's got this nice rainbowish color here, uh, big colors, bright colors. So it gives your site a different look. Okay? If I go back to my dashboard, I can always change back and change to another theme. And what's great about some themes is that you can change certain things about them. So if you don't like certain colors, so under theme options, when you click on a certain theme, so under this theme I could change the background. The header is that image at the top. If I click on header here, if you're good at Photoshop, I can always change this. So if I upload an image here, if I don't like what it says here, I can always make something in Photoshop that's this size, upload it for my computer, right? I could change the colors, I could change the text, I could change the color of the text, I could change the background image, and there's sometimes some theme options, and each theme has different things, so I can organize things in a different way. Maybe I don't want a sidebar, maybe I just want the full width, right? You could add your Twitter feed or Flickr feed here, and I'm going to click Save, Go back to my site. Now there's nothing on the side here. Okay, so maybe I don't want all those things on the side. So now it's a different look. So with just with the click of a mouse, you can quickly change your theme and change the look of your site without changing the content.